Hello, everybody. This is my first live video. You know what? Kind of excited. It's a long time coming. Uh, for the 75 subscribers that I already have, I appreciate every, each every one of you guys. And of course, I followed you back. And uh, this one is special to me because I um, it's not totally a comic book video. Oh, I do have a couple books that I did get in today, but I had a box that I got in today I was so excited about that I had to share it with you guys. Now, I hope it's as good as I think it is. Uh, it's a guy. Matter of fact, I'm, I'm going to unbox it first. But this book that I got today, I did have already unboxed it. I'm going to show it to you guys. Everyone, know, everyone knows I collect black comic book hero, heroes, and this is one of my favorite ones that I've gotten so far. Uh, this is Batwing number 20. And I was able to catch it out in a 9.8. I think I'm gonna pay like $80 for it, man. And ladies. It's a dope book right there. Look at that. Uh, that a book in a 9.8. This book is definitely gonna go on my wall. So some something is coming down, and this one is going up. Uh it's this one. This one's definitely a keeper for me. And like I said on one of my posts on IG, a grail does not always have to be an expensive book, man. It could be a $30 book, but it could be one of those books that has eluded you for so far, for so long, that you finally, you know what? This is a grail. Uh, this book right here, this is definitely going to be on one of the auctions soon. This is Megaton number three. This is the first appearance of Savage Dragon, I believe. It's a dope cover, though. So this one will be coming to a auction near you. All right. And I also got a book from Gino Bonino. Uh, it's, it's so crazy. I just sold this book. Uh, I got this in today. But uh, I was able to get this from Gino Bonino, and I appreciate it. And it's in great condition. He said near mint. And it is near mint. This is Stars and Stripes, bro. First appearance. Her name is Stargirl. At number one. It's in mint condition. Kind of excited about that. Thank you, Gino. Appreciate you. Another pillar in our community. And I also got these books today. You know, I, I like to collect those foreign books. And when a guy sent it to me, he sent it to me in, in this right here. Yes. But it was not egging boards, and they were all piled up on top of each other in this contraption right here. But you know, it, it did come. It did come. It was not in bad condition, but I was able to put them in mylars and then in okay condition. Um, I will say near mint, but not near mint plus. It was Amazing Spider-Man number three sixty one. And what's special about this book, guys? This is the Australian variant, which I think is kind of dope. And I also got three sixty two Australian variant. And 363. This one is actually in beautiful condition right here. Maybe a 90 candidate. Who knows? It's also this Australian variant. And that's all the books I got today. But what moved me to make this video? You know, I usually don't make videos. It's my first video. I'm going to try to get a better habit of doing this. I got a box today that I got from this guy. And I ordered from, I, it was off of eBay. And if you want to know where I got it from, just, you know, hit me in the comments. Let me know. But this is a special unboxing to me. And this is how big the box is. So I started opening it. I didn't look at any of them yet because it's four. It's four different things in here. And I'm going to show them individually. And you will see them on the wall behind me very soon, hopefully. All right, so let's start digging in. All right. Okay, there's some good packaging here, good packaging. Okay. This is the first one. Let me try to carefully open it. Oh, wow. You know what? This is the first one. And I'm highly impressed. I'm going to have to give this guy a huge shout out. 
because he killed this. You guys know I collect Hellraiser type of you know type of objects and uh collectibles. So I saw this on eBay. This guy makes these from scratch. Makes these from scratch. And I'm not sure if you guys are familiar with Hellraiser the movie. Now I do believe in God. What's up, Don Dizzle? You're my first commenter. And I'm gonna give you, I'm gonna send you a book, brother. I'm gonna send you a book. But yeah, what I was talking about, Don Dizzle, I got my um a box in today. And everyone knows I could like hair razor things. I got my pen head right here. But I am a Christian man. I do believe in God. I'm just a fan of the, you know, of the movies. But got this in today. If tell me that's not dope. That is beautiful artwork. Dope. Now I'm gonna try to get get this one on the wall. We have three more to unbox. That's dope. Just kidding. <laughs> All right. Let's see what the next one looks like. Don Dizzle, you my first guy on my stream outside of my wife. You know, I think she's watching too. I'm not giving her anything. But I'm gonna send you something, brother. And I appreciate the support. And like I said, I'm unboxing my uh my little uh, I guess they call it, like little statues. Bus, that's what they're called. Bus. Thanks, babe. Okay, so each one comes with things that you have to add on to them. Oh, this is freaking dope right here. This guy is talented. And inside of each one, he has autographed it and let you know when he made it. And this is the other guy. I forgot his name. I think his name is uh damn it. I had to read it down. Uh, what's this guy's Butter. name? Butter. Yes. He's also from Hellraiser, one of the Cenobites. And he also comes with the glasses. That's dope. That is dope. Let me see if I can get them all. Let me see. Oh. Tell me that's not dope. Tell me that's not dope. This is a talented man. Talented man. That is dope. All right. We have two more to, un to unlock. Let me see if I can get this one open without messing anything up. Let me see. Hey, Don Dizzle. You know what? They're pretty light, man, because the box was... I want to say the box altogether is probably like about 10 pounds. They're very light, man. Very light. I'm not sure exactly what they're made out of. I'm not the best guesser, guesser of weight. Let me see. If I had to guess how much this one weighed... I say maybe two pounds. What's up, Daniel Burrow? You know what? I'm gonna send you a book too, brother. I told my man Don Dizzle. I said you're my first first person on my stream. I'm gonna send him a book. I'm also sending you a book. So whoever the third one is, I'm gonna send them a book too. And my wife, you don't count. So the next person that comment, I'm gonna send you a book. Now, I'm gonna do a recap of the books that I um that I did unbox already. But the main reason why I was doing this unboxing was for these busts that I got today of uh the Hellraiser characters. Let me see. This one right here, this is the Chatterer. Oh, that's dope. That is dope. That is dope. That is dope. And again, he has his autograph on the inside. Of when he made it. That is dope. What do you guys think? That's dope. All right, so we missing one one guy. Last but not least, it gotta be my man Pinhead. Gotta be Pinhead. And yes, and it Joker, what's up, brother? Hey, I see the third the first three people to comment. Was gonna get a book, so I'm sending you a book, Joker. So let me write this down there because you know I will forget. I got Don Dizzle, Don Dizzle, Daniel Burrow, and my man Joker, the number one MC in the land. Let me show you. Let me show you the other ones. A recap, real quick. We got the Chatterer so far.
We got my man Butters. Looking like Roman Curtis out. No, I'm just playing. Shout out to Roman Curtis. That's dope. That's dope. And the detail in this lady right here, this latest is just look at that. That is crazy. That looks kind of erotic right there. So let me, let me see. Mm -mm. Just kidding. But that's dope. <laughs> that's dope. So we're gonna do pinhead last. All right. And all like I said, I did unbox a few um books today. Um We'll go over those real quick. There we go. We got these three Australian variants. This is a this is a dope book right here, man. Like I said, it's Australian variant. As you can see, it says a dollar and eighty cent Australian. So you got 361, 62, and 63. Yeah, man, this live video is a long time coming. I've been on Thorold so many auctions now. I ain't even nervous no more. <laughs> And I got these ones right from Gino Bonino. Greatly appreciated, brother. They were in great condition, just like you said. And, and Joker, you're going to be proud of me on this one, Joker. I got some DC goodness. This one is definitely going on the wall. This is uh, Batwing number 20 in the 9-8. This one is going to the wall. And like I said, I think I caught this book for like 80 bucks, man, in the auction. I was kind of kind of stoked about that. You know you get hype about stuff like that. And this one is going to be on the auction right here. This is a Megatron, Megaton number three. Number three, I'm sorry. This is the first Savage Dragon, I do believe. Correct me if I'm wrong. Uh -huh. All right. But last but not least, my man Pinhead right here. Oh, he got some on the inside of this one. Okay, hold up. Wait a minute. Let me be careful. I don't want to knock one of his pins off. Hold on. But in the inside of it, oh, that's dope. Wait a minute. This, this, yeah. And a guy, you know, it's, these came from Romania. The guy sent me a um, a message. I ordered probably like about months ago. But he sent me a yeah. message. A about a month. Yeah. He sent me a message. You know, he, he apologized for the delay in the shipping. But we understand this COVID-19 crisis is going on right now. You know, stuff like this is going to happen. I wasn't tripping. But I do appreciate him reaching out, though. I'm just letting get this pinhead out right here. Oh, my goodness. Oh. Bro, he's shitting on you, bro. He's shitting on you, bro. Ah. This one right here is dope. If I can get it out without messing the pen up and cutting myself. I need a I need one of those Chad unboxing knives. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Oh my god, that is dope. Okay. Wow. This is dope. But on the inside, he does have a picture of Pinhead in his human form, which is dope. That is dope. But look at the anguish in this man's face right here. That's how I look when I'm behind my... No, man. <laughs> this is dope. Beautiful. This is beautiful art. Beautiful. Wow. These will definitely be going up on the wall. <sighs> Mm, mm, mm. Very happy with these. This is like one of the best. Like when I got this box in today, I said, you know what? I have to do an unboxing because if they're off, I'm gonna let it be known and I'm gonna tag his ass in them. But I say if they dope, I'm gonna let it be known and I'm gonna tag them in it. Like these are awesome. Even his teeth. Look, look at the teeth. Oh my goodness. And this is short comparison. I bought, I bought this from a comic book convention. It was pretty dope. I still do like it. But this because it's great detail in this right here. But this is like rubber. You know, I, I don't know how he made this. I think he used like a, uh, I don't know what he used. Did a great job on this, though. But the detail in this art right here is just, oh, my goodness. I, I don't know how good it's coming up on the camera, but it's dope. Real good. Yeah. So that's all I got, folks. Uh, I appreciate everyone that came through. And like I said, Don Dizzle. We got um, Daniel Burrow and Joe. Y'all were the first to comment on my first live video. I'm definitely going to send you guys a book for my appreciation. I, I greatly appreciate it. I really do, man. Um, I'll holler at you guys later. I don't know how to end it, so let's see. Oh, end stream. There you go. All right, fellas.